Bro, that he envy me. So many guys like a name with them niggas deceased. Fuck that, I'm about to get disrespectful. AJ crashing the free and they let you. No, I got stopped, but nobody was dead. Lottie and Natty got poke and nobody was dead. DOA, DOA, DOA. Don't point anything. The end. So, it's been a lot of internal conflict between people in DOA and, you know, some of the affiliates also. And today's newest beef is B-Love and Set the Trend. So, Set the Trend came out with a snippet and he basically dissed Noah Baller and he got a lot of people hot. And one of the people was B-Love. B-Love went to his Instagram and wrote, Ninjas dissing but ain't stepping. Watch how we teach him a lesson. I mean, that sounds like a good rap. I hope <laughs> I hope B-Love coming out with a song. <laughs> like, because that sounds good. Um, and then he wrote, everybody disrespectful and everybody got a date. Set the trend responded and said, everybody does have a date, but some ninjas dates come a little earlier. Wow. So I'm not sure how close they were, like as far as like not no internet shit, like in real life, but I do know that they do have bros in common to where, you know, B-Love is super close to K-Block. K-Block is real close to set the trend. So it, it does make it weird. My opinion is this. B-Love is in a tough situation. I know a lot of people make fun of him and say he's playing both sides and he makes it. Me personally, I thought he was taking the grown man stance. I thought he was taking like the stance like all this beef shit is dumb. Let's focus on getting money. Let's focus on rap. But the thing is, you can't pick and choose when you're going to focus on being a grown man and when you want to start beefing, dog. You feel me? Even that situation is weird. K-Flock being your bro, but K-Flock also being set to trend, bro. And then set the trend dissing a legend from your neighborhood. That's just too much. It's just too much going on, dog. And the reality is, with this drill stuff nowadays, they're going to keep mentioning Noah's name. They're going to keep dissing your desk. They're going to keep dissing people in your neighborhood or whoever. But the, the weird part about it is just basically your bro friend dissed somebody from your neighborhood. Like, you know, you would think that he would have some kind of like, you know, just some kind of like, discretion to be like yo i ain't gonna diss him because he cool with him but they don't be caring nowadays all they care about is attention and i think set the trend is one of them people that fall into that category where it's like yo clout over everything i don't care the only advice i can give be love dog is just stay out dog stay out the way rock with your people you a mainstream artist and don't worry about the bullshit they're gonna keep dissing your dads it's sad but it's gonna happen this is one of the bad parts of kind of playing both sides you know, you rock with who you rock with, just keep rocking with him, dog. Because at the end of the day, all this BS in the hood, all this random beef, it is not worth it, man. You got hit records out and stuff like that. So don't even let somebody trick you out your position, man. And set the trend, dog. Like, what's the point? Like, what are you getting out of this and Noah Baller? You probably never even met that dude. Like, you probably never will meet anybody that even know him like that. Like, what's the point, man? Like, that's not even your generation for real. You're a rapper trying to make it out, too. All this distant and dead stuff, man, it's a wrap for it. Digital thugs, I'm out. Like, comment, subscribe.